name is Sylvain, Senior Tech Trainer over at Defection and Volcan. Today, we will visit the software and the technical menu. To do so, we will need the door key and the service key. On the secure ID inside the machine, you will find the model number, serial number, power, and water requirements. Open the door and insert the EO service key. If you go into service mode, press on the Nectar icon. Long enough says to get the prompt to enter the password. Then the first thing you will notice is the dashboard, where you find the unit serial number, boiler temperature, all the basic info for your machine. In service mode, you also got the nice feature that is the search bar. In case you're looking for something and don't know exactly where to go, use the search bar like this. Type a keyword. Setting, date and time. Access the date and time settings menu 8.3. To the date or time, click the appropriate pencil icon. You can also set time zone. When done, click on save. Setting install date. Access the installation date menu 4.5. You can also use the search bar. To edit the installation date, click on the pencil icon and set the date, month and year. When completed, click on Save. Changing the language. Access the Languages menu 8.4. You can also use the search bar. Set the primary language for both user screen and technical menu. To do so, drag and drop the flag corresponding to the language you wish. You can also set up to three languages for the user interface, including the primary language. Once done, click Save, then Exit Service Mode. To import or export a backup, you will need an empty USB stick, pre-formatted FAT32. Access the Backup Menu 7.4. Insert the USB stick inside the port on the board. Click export and follow the instructions on the screen. Once the backup is completed, click Eject USB and retrieve the stick from the board. Access the backup menu 7.4. Insert the USB stick inside the port on the board. Select the backup file on screen, then click import and follow the instruction on screen.
Once the backup is completed, select the settings to import your new machine and click open. The system will reboot. To retrieve the cup count of your machine, you can either look on the mechanical counter inside the door, or go through the software to retrieve the cup count. Access the Show Statistics menu 4.2.1. You can also use the search bar. You will find a list of how many cups each drink has been made. Programming your recipes. Access the Recipes and Use menu 2.3.4.1. All activated recipes are listed in this menu. To edit a recipe, click on the appropriate pencil icon. The diagram shows not the composition of the selected drink along with other general information. To adjust the component of the drink, click on this button, then on Edit, and set the values Then use the test button to test the drink after changing the recipe. When completed, click on Save. Adjusting the coarseness using the adjustment knob. Turn clockwise to make it finer, counterclockwise to make it coarser. Mark the knob before making any adjustment. Coffee shoot removal. Unclip the funnel and slide it towards the right to remove. To reinstall the funnel, align the notch with the tab, then push the funnel towards the left. Make sure to hear it click in place.